and it would be a proper vimp video without a nice preface to the video guys so what's up guys we're going to be playing some enfos ffb we're going to be playing one of the newest uh versions at the moment also on top of that we're going to be playing the new hero the everlasting flame the, this guy is an absolute monster of a hero he does he's like a kind of a caster and he does so much freaking damage his spells are freaking epic i just love how the uh, map developer strikeist uh, awesome guy by the way um i'm going to be playing with him uh during the game so big shout out to the guy i'll also have the links down in the description of his twitch and his discord so i definitely do recommend you guys go check him out but apart from that yeah he's just so good at you know map developing i feel like it's just so clean and like so different of a map and that's why you see like some people like soda poppin which are you know massive streamers that play this game which is so funny to see that you know these massive streamers come back and play these like um you know these workout three customs which are super awesome so anyways guys uh enough rambling enjoy the game this we're, this was played versus like a few tryhards so this is going to be a tough matchup hopefully you guys will enjoy this without further ado guys enjoy the video I haven't played Enfos in a bit, but uh, like I said before, the other recording is uh, Mr. Stragus reset reached out and uh, mapped the developer and was like, hey, we got new heroes and uh, let's showcase them on the YouTube channel. Why not? Why not? Should be pretty fun. What's our hero comp at the moment? Is it any good? It's, it's oh my. Excuse me. <laughs> The <laughs> look at the models, dude. They look so sick. <laughs> oh, oh no. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm just a castle. It's just a custom. Right? Just okay, dude. Oh, the ogre lord. So it's two citadels, right? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. I love that. So, anyways, let's talk a little bit about this uh, new character, which he looks freaking epic. I played him once. Um. He is pretty fun, not gonna lie. So his passive is all shall burn. Essentially, every time we're hitting a unit, it has like this burning oil effect, doing damage over time on the floor. Um, it does damage based on your intelligence. Explosion damage is based on maximum health. It stacks damage. And uh, yeah, explosion area of effect is 275. So yeah, looking pretty spicy. Um, also, this... Flame Turbine, as you guys saw at the beginning, is like an AoE um, circular um, damage type or kind of like AoE around me. It does quite a bit of damage. Um, yeah. This Molten Wave is a little bit similar to the Flame Strike. So I'm obviously just a fire character, right? So you guys will see as we play the game what my abilities do. They are pretty spicy, to say the least. But I, I get indulgence first, just so I can stack in, because he has low in game. You're supposed to, your passive gives you hit, and so that's the way you're supposed to Gotcha. Let's use my G, and here we go. Yeah. Pretty strong ability, kind of like AoE. So the thing is with like two, so apparently you can stack these citadels. Obviously they have like uh, quite a bit of range, they can, they can summon units. So we'll see like the dynamic of this game, having two citadels could be very interesting. Um, oh, yeah. It's on the bright side, we do have a Queen of Pain, which is going to be kind of tanking for us. We have summons that also are going to be tanking for us, hopefully. But yeah, it's going to be a very interesting dynamic, to say the least. Let's get ourselves a little bit of extra mana. I'll probably use my Molten Wave. Or maybe oh, I think pig. Turbine is better. Uh, I usually max the Turbine, because the G gives, is mostly attacks. Yeah, so G... So as you guys will see, the, the next abilities are pretty powerful. It's just, uh, I'll explain in due time. But yeah, Turbine is pretty good for clearing. So is F. Like, this character is really good at clearing wave. Um, so yeah, we'll see how he, he you know, survives late game. So my X ability is uh, Marks of Spot. Essentially what this does is uh, I can stack up to 10 of these circles. Um, they do damage... So, uh, they only do damage based whenever I detonate them, right? Yep. So, they also do damage based on the... Obviously, this is an intelligence hero, so it all my abilities mostly skill off of each, um, intelligence, obviously. It marks a target, and you can detonate the the, um, the area. And it can also um, mark a lot of areas, which is pretty good. So, I could stack them. And if I'm in a very dire, dire situation, I can pretty much, like, detonate if I really okay. want to. 
Yeah, you can manually select them to detonate, to choose which you want to teleport to and detonate, or if you press your detonate skill on your hero, it just teleports you to the hero. And to which one? Does it the most recent one? The nearest here. Or it's towards the... To, uh, okay. Towards the closest one? Yeah, towards the closest room. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay. There we go. Invisible units. We got extra wards, so we should be in a pretty good spot to hold these waves. Yeah. Put some wards you on can the tell which, which side the boss comes from based on the auras. Oh, that's, that's a very cool. Uh, yeah. So right side. That's a very cool way of uh, seeing this. That's nice. Use flame turbine to hopefully kill the champion. The most important thing is in this map is definitely killing the uh, champions just for the single fact that. They give out a lot of auras, they do quite a bit of damage, and uh, yeah, yeah, it's, it's just, just a priority target. Yeah, it's just not a fun time to have a bunch of them on you. Yeah, and the auras stack, right? So you definitely want to yeah. take them out as soon as possible. Yeah, so, uh, I mean, this the two citadels are kind of interesting. So they, they, they spawn in the bottom. If you die, they spawn up top uh, in, the, in the circle, right? No, they spawn, they spawn here always. Oh, I died! Oh, crap. This that's, is that's, bad. That's, that's gonna be a wipe. Oh, no. <laughs> you, we should use slow or something. Maybe. Uh, <laughs> we can that's no good. Okay, wait. I'm, I'm coming up. I'm coming up. I don't care about this. Uh, we need to keep the citadel up, up there, right? Yeah. Well, we respawn up here, so it's, it's a bad situation if the team can't go here. Oh, wait! I use my... I didn't click on the potion. That sucks. Wait, you respawn in the bottom? I respawn in the same location. Oh, I actually didn't know. I thought you you changed it? No, before it was a bug that you respawned in the circle. Ah, that's pretty cool, actually. Yeah, it, it, it keeps things interesting. Uh, so this, I love the fact that you can move very easily towards uh, different locations. So I could put like an X in different areas and just like uh, move uh, around the map pretty easily. Yeah. That's actually nice. I like that. So for example, if I really want to shop, I can move to, to like a different area. This, this is so, like there's so many cool combinations we could do with this. Yeah. You can just like teleport to the middle of the mob. And yeah. Because it deals more damage the closer you are to them, because there's more explosions. So the optimal way of playing this character, obviously going rushing indulgence so we can get stacking intelligence. Um, I probably want to, you know, spam my X's as much as possible to have them around the map and it gives, gives me options, obviously. And probably just meh or using F as much as possible the turbines, right? This is a good way to stack um, it, so just spam your G, because you know, you try to get 10 stacks. My E? Stacked. Your G. Oh, so my G, my G, okay. Stacked. Yeah, because the whole point is to get a lot of int to stack. Well, just spamming your spells in general. Okay, so G is the, the way to go. Well, G and X both give attacks to me. Okay, I got you. You see, you see that little explosion it did? It did bonus damage, and then... Uh, uh, burning. Them. Oh, I see the bur Oh, yeah, I see the little explosion. I got you. Okay. And then you get a little a permanent hit bonus. Yeah, look at the attack speed bonus from the G. Super, really good. He, my, uh, <laughs> my viewer uh, DC'd again. Black so much. <laughs> but I mean, they're uh, pretty good, so. Yeah, it happens. Happens to the best of us. I wouldn't need to use uh, my V here. Uh, Would be good, you know? Good. good. Let's use it. Channeling, uh, so... Wait, oh. I mean, just oh. use it for the fun of it. Look at this freaking <laughs> animation, man. Okay, it didn't do much, but... <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's because uh, you summoned the uh, ritual or something? What happened? Uh, I used my ult. Ah, that's why. Dude, my character did like a freaking epic Naruto move and you literally just like... <laughs> 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 Completely wrecked my moment, man. <laughs> you'll, have, you'll have more moments. Yeah, I'll have more moments. Don't worry. I'm not worried. That was a pretty cool ultimate, though. Yeah, it's fun. 
My damage turned to stack quite a bit. Very nice, very nice, very nice. Hopefully we can kill the one on the left, with the, which is the champion. Everlasting Flame. Such a cool ult ultimate. So now at this point we're just going to be stacking the mexes or the uh, kind of the marks on the floor. Makes me think a little bit of uh, what's the character called in Dota that puts marks on the flames? I don't know if that was your inspiration. Maybe it was. Uh, I don't remember. You don't know? Okay. Oh, you mean Templar Assassin? Maybe? Yes, yes, exactly. Templar Assassin, yes. It's kind of different. His version is slow. Well, yeah, think. it slows, but you know, the marks on the floor, you know what I mean? It has a yeah. similar kind of feel to it. I'm not, gonna, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not saying that, you know, you took the idea from there. I'm just saying it has a similar feel. Oh, well, yeah, no, I can switch between by that. Yeah, sure. exactly. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. I like that. So, I mean, I should probably, use, should I use my X's as much as possible? I feel like, or just keep them, I feel like. Um, I feel like if you need to use them, use them. Why not? Uh, but, like, having a bunch on the floor as backup is always good, too. Alright, I think... I mean, I have so much mana, I might as well just use my... Everlasting Flame! Let's go, Naruto! Ninetale, oh, Fox! Good. Let's go! Let's see what you got! Boom! Oh my god, so he does, like, a lot of AoE damage in this circle, I guess. It doesn't even... Does it... I feel like I don't have enough intel. It's still doing Boy. a decent amount. Well, it, is, it applies your passive blows people up at 10 stacks, and apply stacks super easily, so... Okay, I see. Dude, I'm... And at the end, uh, it also does a final explosion, so... Only thing is I'm lacking mana, man. What am I a problem at the moment? Um, you can always get a frag garage, I guess. Yeah, I, I desperately need one. It's so bad. Okay. Because I, I would love to spam my abilities, and I feel like, um, yeah, it'll go for a little bit of agility somehow. I mean, it gives you agility already, no? Uh, it gives attack speed. I mean, you don't need agility because you got two spells with attack speed steroids. Wait. Yo, this boss is decent. <laughs> okay. Alright, so should I rush uh, Indulgence first, or should I go for... I feel like it, it's, I'm far away from indulgence, so probably just getting the blade. Yeah, well, you might as well. Frag rush is cheap. It doesn't delay your builds too much. Oh yeah, you're right. It's not. It's really cheap. Okay. I'll try to get boots too. Finish them up. Why not? Why not? Why not? Usually these boots are pretty good. Uh, I need that extra mobility. It does help. All right, let's use my uh, detonate. Oh, dude, look at that mobility, man. Oh, dude, yeah, it's so, so satisfying. Oh, look at that damage. All right, that's what and I'm talking about. All your stack they stack. So, oh, they stack? Okay. Yeah. Well, at least for the duration. Dude, this is so satisfying. Queen of Pain does, uh to remember that she drains mana. She's out the game! <laughs> <laughs> okay, they're doing well, considering that they're playing with uh, less players. Yeah, they're doing uh, the uh, terror build. Yeah, they're good players. All right. I see a difficult game. Let's see if they can handle two freaking, you know, Citadels plus this freaking Fire Lord Beast. Ah, oh, look at that. I killed the, the boss on the right if we can. Um, yeah, sure. That was the main issue at the moment. There we go. Alright, stack the passive. They're doing a certain amount of damage. I'm taking a lot of damage too. I'm very low health. Yeah, I, that's why I like to get the, the Shard of Ragnaros. It gives a lot of each. I usually get that after my indulgence. Okay, so you, you get shard first. Oh uh, no, I get indulgence just to get my Oh you're right, yeah. Up. Okay. And then and then some tank items to just shard of Ragnaros because of a bunch of shit. Yeah, that makes sense. I mean Fragraft is so good on this hero just because I can spam abilities, man. <laughs> just 
gonna be like a moving like glass cannon. That's what I'm gonna be. Okay, we need to keep, take out these bosses ASAP because that's quite a bit of them stacking. So I'll try to focus uh, this one, hopefully. I can use my ultimate. Yeah, you know what? Yeah. I'm gonna use my ultimate. Hopefully they stay there. Oh, hopefully they don't die. Okay, never mind. <laughs> no! Oh, I can still use my, my detonate. Yeah, you can. That's pretty good. Oh, there we go. He used the pop There we go. Okay, what is that? Oh my god, Demonic Commander. Jesus! Yeah, that's the new, that's the finished signal. Hello, please help. Team? Oh, uh, I'm helping. <laughs> help! <laughs> okay, we're good, we're good. Alright, I can't stack those potions. That sucks. Sometimes you can and sometimes you can't. What's the deal with that? The greater potions, you can stack them. Yeah. Yeah, okay, I need inventory spots, maybe. Uh, they should just combine automatically. They should, but they didn't. Fine, it's fine, it's fine. Let's not panic. Okay, so, I mean, I could upgrade this Elven Plate Mill. Probably would be good, but I feel like I just want to rush Indulgence, I feel like, as soon as possible. Okay, when I get stack in... I'm gonna start getting that, uh, those stacks. Oh, wait! Oh, I blinked. Dude, I blinked uh, as I was dying. My death animation <laughs> went to the, uh, that different mark. Okay. But I could escape there. Rip. <laughs> nice. We got it. Peace. <laughs> tank, oh, here it comes. Wait, we're killing the tank this easily? <laughs> oh. We're just bombarding you. <laughs> oh, dude, come on, man. <laughs> dude, it was, uh, okay, Citadel seems to be the counter to, to tanks, apparently. And yeah, they have pretty good uh, heroes. Aladdin, very good weaponsmith, but very good tank. Arcane, Mistress. Plus the Eye of the Void. I've done some builds. I know you saw the uh, the other video. Uh, I can't really remember. Rip. Getting that extra, extra HP boost is pretty good. Whenever you teleport to a specific area, but I'm still very vulnerable. I have a little bit yeah, of armor, but... It doesn't last long. It's just there so you don't get blown up instantly once you teleport into the box. It gives you enough time to, like, cast up things or find maybe to clear it. Yeah, and then run away. I see kite back yeah. or something. Yeah, I like that. That's a good addition. But I literally have 1.3k health. Like, that's nothing. <laughs> yeah, that's why after diligence, I would get, I would start getting certain items. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yo, yeah, I'll get the, uh, I'll get the, the, the uh, staff and then afterwards we'll, we'll begin. At least hopefully. Yeah, I like the I like the feel of this hero for sure. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. I love the fact that I'm so mobile. I like the fact that I have so many abilities to cast, and you know, there's so much, so much to this champion. You know what I mean? Yeah, sure. It's not limited. Yeah, the skill ceiling is pretty high. I can't play him that well either. Yeah. It's, oh, what is that mobility increase? Oh, it's because of the champion or something. Yeah, here we no, go. they just berserk. Yeah, I can literally just okay. So this is what's nice. A really co good combo would be like uh, using my X, teleporting in, then blinking out with uh, Wait, boots, yeah. with my boots. Okay, I like that. That's really really cool. Using an ability, blinking out. Yeah, that's that's definitely how to play this. Okay, so you got a good combo in. That's a deadly combo. Did I die? <laughs> Dude, I'm literally like vulnerable as a little leaf or something. Okay, at least I have enough uh, for the staff. Okay, so let's get perfect indulgence. So grants the user 70, 72 intelligence, also gives a chance to hold it to permanently increase intelligence. 
Really freaking strong. Because you can clear the little mob that they spawn really easily with your F, with any of your AOE spells. So, sorry, what did you say? Uh, indulgence has active. Yeah. So when you use it on an enemy, if you kill it, it spawns 10 little minions and you can clear them out with AOE. Oh, no so way. That gives, you more, that gives you a lot of kills so you can stack up your indulgence faster. So our teammate left. Usually it's that's fine. not good. It's fine. Okay, I mean, I got some items, but yeah, I don't know how I'm feeling about that. That's, uh, you know, it's three versus three, so hopefully we're going to be fine. But the problem is, um, I'm alone, and I'm not a tank. <laughs> so I might need your help to pull me for Ragnarok. Ragnaros. So that's for in sure. the crystals? Yeah, I'll give you 45k to get a uh, ring. So wait, so uh, it's, it's, it's a shard of Ragnaros. I need... 40, 40k, 400k, sorry. Oh, now I'm here. Now I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> All right, this calls for Naruto. But it's channeling, it takes a little bit of time, but I just, I want to see this. Look at this. Boom. Kills everything in the center. I swear if it doesn't kill this, like, ult this uh, champion, it's a bad ultimate. Oh, that, that guy's <laughs> magic. So. Oh no, it didn't work. He's magic immune. So. Oh, he's magic immune. Okay, gotcha. <laughs> are all, yeah, all of these are magic immune. Uh, no, those are magic resistant. They take 90% damage from them. Gotcha. And they have 90% magic resistance. Aim. I think this is coming soon. Yeah, I need to buy myself the uh, shard ASAP. Oh! Yeah, this is tough. This is tough. We need to... I mean, can I even tank for us? I don't think so, necessarily, because they have a tank compared to us. Good. damage. Wait, I can use ultimate again. Why not? Oh, well, too late. <laughs> nice. Um, can I cancel it? No. <laughs> Dude, it's, I, I do it for the uh, the show, okay? It's about sending a message. <laughs> Don't come this way, man. <laughs> yeah, I gotta show up myself. What's up? Oh, man. <laughs> These are magic man. Yeah, yeah, just use your G that you want. My G? My Axe man. I'll use my ult. I have it. I have it. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's, that's a good time to use it. Yeah, yeah they, they, aren't these like magic green or something? No, they're just magic resistant. Oh, he uses ult too. We had, we had to, right? This is kind of a tough round. Oh, these guys are holding so easily, it's funny. <laughs> Woo! This is heated! We're approaching like final stage of the game, so. Here comes the champion. I, would, I wouldn't stress. Hey, maybe stress a little. That guy hurts. Oh, shoot. Okay. <laughs> yeah, no mana. Okay, he's dead. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, you should definitely be popping the indulgence more. Yeah, indulgence, yeah, so I get more sprocks, right? Uh, chances at getting extra, yeah, switch more. Because essentially, I get intelligence based on it's a percentage chance of getting uh, extra intel intelligence. On kill, on kill, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I see what you mean. So I have to cast it as much as possible. Still lacking mana, man. Uh, attack more. What can I say? <laughs> Dude, use your brain more, man. Come on. <laughs> okay, I should be able to get it. So Grimstone, two more Bloodstones. Got it. Is that it? 
Uh, is that Shard of Ragnaros? Do I need more Bloodstones? You need one of Bloodthirst now. Okay. No, I died. That's not good. Bloodthirst, where can I find that? Right here, 65k. 65k. Drop something. There we go. Got it. There we go, boys. Now we're OP. Now I'm a tank. Wait, I, I have a. I don't have a TP? Guess not. I guess now I do. I guess right. now you should like either get a victory mail or like a shadow mark. At this point, well, I don't even know, man. Maybe a victory mail. Oh! I'm just gonna kite. Dude, this guy got full HP somehow. Uh, he has wings, yeah. He didn't earn the deal with wings. Oh, wait, Oops. what? I got one shot? Yeah, apparently. Do you need gold? I'll give you gold if you want. Uh, I'll give you, just give back if you don't need it. Uh, if you can yeah, build something, I, I don't know. Because I'm, I'm pretty much dead at the moment. Alright, use ultimate. Here we go. Okay, now it's doing a decent amount of damage. Okay. That's what I'm talking about. I run. I would run. Yeah, okay, I like running. I can't, <laughs> apparently. No! My TP <laughs> blink was... My blink boots were on cooldown. It's fine. Let's not talk about it. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Well, we can't handle anything at the bottom, so good luck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, thanks, dude. I guess. I got this point, don't worry. Your damage is decent. Yeah, it's okay. But you know, their damage is fine too. I don't know what I'm getting hit by. Oh, it's invisible units. Oh, yeah. I completely forgot about those. Okay, so now I know I need to cast a lot more around this shirt. I'll send some summons down your way. Here we go. Oh no. Oh no. We got this, I believe. I'm holding boys somehow. Oh, oh I am no. summoning a sun down there. No! How did I get, like, one shot there? What? Okay, we're fine. Yeah, we're good, we're good. I got so much money, man. Uh, I passed that along, man. Oh Dude, I God, got man. you, my man. Here you oh go, just God. casually giving okay. you one million. <laughs> okay. Spend it well, my friend. Spend it well. I, I can make I can make something work. Yes. Sure. Yeah. Go. 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 That or uh, make me some. Uh, make me the other one if you can. So what am I missing? Uh, for? No, I, I'm more worried about trying to carry right now. So yeah. Go ahead. Can, do do your thing. Me. Wait. You have oh the skull cleaver. Okay. Ooh, oh, never oh, mind. No. <laughs> <laughs> I was too busy shopping. Okay. This is great. Dude, I don't- I do zero damage. Oh, those are so I, um... Those have, um, spell resistance. That's good to know. Yeah. That's really good to know. Oh, yeah, I casually get, uh, you know, mana burn for my whole mana bar. That's fine, too. 15 seconds. What do I do? You just stall. I'll, I'll be able to. I'll be able to summon stuff for you soon. Uh. Can I ulti? What do I do? Dude, I, I feel like I'm doing fine, but uh, it's not gonna be enough for sure. Oh, you got some. It's nice. No, I died. Oh, I might die too. 
Maybe get crit. Maybe get stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I don't have. I don't know. I don't have time for this. <laughs> I can't like. I, I'll use ultimate. For the fact that you have like zero items. Yeah, I have zero damage. I have zero items. I don't have time to shop. That's the problem with. Maybe that was a bad ultimate, but I mean. Uh, it's, it's, it's doing a decent amount. It's better than all of them leaking. Oh, please. <laughs> Oh, how am I still alive? <laughs> you have money you can't even spare because you're gonna die. Dude, no, no, wait, what? Oh, oh you're bad. <laughs> no, stop it. Stop, don't move. Please, dude, I have one million gold. I don't know. Okay, can we pause the game? <laughs> For what? <laughs> 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 okay, what do I buy? We have so much... Dude, we have so much gold, what do we do? Uh, maybe get a crit and get a victory mail. You need a courier, that's what you need. It's a job for you. Okay, how do I how buy do a buy courier? A Isn't that like, oh. like a full item that I could buy here? Oh yeah, you can, but you need some wood. Can you get the wood? Uh, sure, but um, we're about to lose, so... <laughs> okay, good luck. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, we have five lives. Yeah, it's it's over. We have to defend this one. No, you bastard! Really? <laughs> Absolute. This guy. This this guy deserves to be kicked after that one. <laughs> He's just playing the game. <laughs> Don't hate Dude, that's to play awesome. Yet. Look at these new models too. Yo, that was a heated moment at the end. I literally had to pause the game. What a goddamn was this film, I'm telling you. Anyways, hope you guys did enjoy this video. This was a fun showcase of the new hero. Um, if you guys want me to kind of try this hero again and kind of, you know, min-max and kind of like optimally build this guy as I'm progressing through the game. It was kind of all over the place, but I feel like it was a fun showcase just because it was kind of heated and, you know, it, it was kind of like uh, authentic in some way. But anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys want to see more of this, obviously you like the video. Subscribe for more, and I'm going to be talking to you guys in the next one. Thank you, guys.